Hello, good evening. Hello. Hi. Good evening. Sorry, I'm late. Oh, it's okay. No problem. Good evening. How are you? I'm good. That's nice to hear. How was your day? What did you do today? Uh, I am learning at school and playing game. Mm -hmm. And uh, playing football. Oh, you play football today. Okay. Did you take a nap? A nap? Nap. Did you take a nap? Wait, nap. I don't know what is nap. Nap. Sleep? Aha, uh -huh, nap. It's it's a kind of a sleep but shorter one. No. I can no. <laughs> Okay, so let's finish the last part. Oh, we are finished with this one, right? You you answered this one already last meeting. Yes. Okay, very good. Now let's have... Okay, so this is listening. Day 9. Okay, so we haven't had this one. Okay, so for listening day nine, we are going to have, uh, we are going to discuss the family. Okay, family. So this is like a family tree. Okay. And we have here, can you see it? Yes. Okay, so we have here the name of the um, grandfather and grandmother. So who is the grandfather? Uh, Jean. Okay, Jean, very good. What about the grandmother? Uh, no. Marie. Marie. Uh, um, okay, Marie, very good. So, Marie and Sean, they do have two offspring or children. It is Dave and Patricia. Okay, so Dave, Mary, Barb. Patricia married Jim. Okay, so this is the father and the mother. Let's say that you are the child, okay? And this is your aunt and uncle. Okay, so let's say that you are uh, Bobby. Oh, no, let's say that you are Victor. <laughs> okay, let's say that you are Victor. Now, your father is Bobby and Amelia. And then uh, your uncle is Harley and your aunt is Andrea. Okay, so Anne and Michael is also your aunt and uncle. Okay, they are cousin of your parents. And you have a sister, Jackie. So Madeline and Tim, they are your cousins. Okay, and then if you are Victor, Sean and Mary or Marie will be your great, great grandmother or grandparents okay okay so that was just an example now let's have vocabulary words i don't know if you are familiar with the vocabulary when it comes to family so i hope you are okay so first words we have what is this word Uh, uncle. Okay, very good. How many uncles do you have? Many. How many? <laughs> I can't count. 
Oh, you can't count. In your mother's side, does your mother have a brother? Yes. Okay, how many is your is your mother's brother? I don't know, many. Oh, there I are can't many. Count. Okay, okay. What about on your 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 father's side? Does your father have a brother? Mm, yes. Oh, and it is also a lot. Yes. Oh, I see. Okay, so great grandfather. Uh huh. So this is great grandfather in your language, I suppose. And then we have what is this? Cousin. Okay, cousin. This is cousin. I I suppose you have a lot of cousins too. Yes. Okay, and then aunt. Okay, this is aunt. What about aunt? Does your mother have a sister? Hmm. A sister. I think yes. Okay, what about your father? Does your father have a sister? Mm. Yes. Yes. Yes? Okay. Okay, what about this word? What is this? Uh, is is grandparent? Okay, grandparents. Very good. And this one is? Is mm, uh, niece. niece. Okay, very good. So this is niece. And we have another one. Nephew. Nephew. Very good. So this is niece and this is nephew. Now, do you have a niece or a nephew? I have. Oh, you already have. Okay, so you are already. I have two nieces. Oh, and you have one nephew. Oh, you are already an uncle. Yes. Uh huh. Okay. Uh, mother-in-law. Uh huh. Please repeat. Mother-in-law. Okay. This is mother-in-law. Okay. Next one. Uh. Cage. Okay, cage. And this is cage. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, now, I want you to choose one word and then use it on a sentence. Mm. No, I have many uncle. I have many uncle. Okay. Okay, so practice one. Uh-huh. Write the correct word next to each family member. Okay. So we have one example over here. We got aunt. Okay, hold on. Let me look for. Hmm. Okay, so uh, what do you call the father's brother? Your father's brother. You can choose your answer here. Okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, you may now start.
What is parent? Parent. Okay, so the parents of your parents. What do you call them? The mother and father of your mother and father. Grandparent. Okay. I uh, don't know what is mother-in-law. Uh, yeah. I forgot. Okay, so my husband's wife, mother is? Mother-in-law. Okay, very good. Can you, uh, can you uh, mother open in the new one? Oh, this is mother-in-law. Yes, but can you open the new one? New? New one. New word? Okay. This one? Oh, uh, yes. All right. Okay. Father, okay. Okay, very good. Okay, so this is practice too, and this one is listening. So I want you to listen very carefully, okay? I will play the audio. Only twice, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. So people are talking about their families. Listen and number the pictures. Ready? Uh. Unit 9, The Family, page 34. 2. Let's listen. People are talking about their families. Listen and number the pictures. One. That's me in the middle. That's my oldest niece, Betsy, on the left. She's in her second year of college. And that's my nephew on the right. He's just finished high school. Oh, he's handsome. Two. That's me on the left. Who are the other two? Those are my sister and brother, Maria and Jose. They're twins. How old are they? They're ten. Three. That's me and my parents. 
Boy, you look just like your dad. No, I don't. Four. This is a picture of my son and daughter. Is your daughter older than your son? Yes, much older. She's 26. How old is your son? He's 17. That's a big difference. Five. These are my parents. And that's my grandmother on the left. How old is she? She's 60. She looks young for 60. Six. This is my father with my uncle and aunt and two cousins. Which one is your father? The one on the left. Oh, yes. Unit 9, The Family, page 34. 2. Let's listen. People are talking about their families. Listen and number the pictures. 1. That's me in the middle. That's my oldest niece, Betty, on the left. She's in her second year of college. And that's my nephew on the right. He's just funny. Oh, he's handsome. Hmm. That's me on the left. Who are the other two? Those are my sister and brother, Maria and Jose. They're twins. How old are they? They're ten. Three. That's me and my parents. Boy, you look just like your dad. No, I don't. Four. This is a picture of my son and daughter. Is your daughter older than your son? Yes, much older. She's 26. How old is your son? He's 17. That's a big difference. Five. These are my parents. And that's my grandmother on the left. How old is she? She's 60. She looks young for 60. Six. This is my father with my uncle and aunt and two cousins. Which one is your father? The one on the left. Oh, yes. Okay, so let's check. Ready? Mm, yes. Okay, so this is number one. Oh, this one is wrong. Okay, uh, this one is correct. You still did well. Very nice. Okay, let's have this one. Okay, so this is practice too. Okay, so for this part, I think I will play the audio three times, okay? Three times. Okay, practice 3.1. People are talking about their families. How many brothers and sisters do they have? So we have an example on number one. So older brother, she got none. Younger brother also, she got none. Older sisters, she got three. And younger sisters, she got none. So if your answer is none, just put zero on it, okay? Uh -huh. If she don't have it. Okay, so let me... Hold on, let me see if... I think the audio is quite... Oh, my volume is already on its highest. Okay. Okay. One. Do you have any brothers and sisters, Stephanie? No brothers. I wish I did, but I've got three sisters. Really? Yeah, and I'm the youngest. Poor you. Two. Tell me about your family, Donna. Well, I've got one brother. He's older than me. What does he do? He's a student. And I've got two younger sisters. Wow, you have a big family. Three. Do you have any brothers or sisters, Bob? Just one. My sister, Anna. Is she older than you? Yes, yeah, she is. She always bosses me around. Four. Tell me about your family, Rosie. 
Well, I come from quite a big family. I've got two brothers, both of them younger than me. Really? Do you have any sisters? Yeah, I have one older and one younger sister. You're lucky. I wish I came from a big family. Five. Do you come from a big family, Tina? No, I'm an only child. It's just me and my parents. Uh. One. Do you have any brothers and sisters, Stephanie? No brother. Dun, dun. I wish I did, but I've got three sisters. Okay, so you don't want to listen again to check if you miss anything? No. Okay, wow, you seem very confident with your answers. So let's see about that. Uh, number one, again, that is an example. So number two, Donna. She got one older brother and two younger sisters. Okay, very good. So Bob, wow, Bob got, ow. Okay, one, very good. Rosie, two, one, one, very good. Ow, oh, Tina, what number is this, my dear? Zero. Okay, very nice. Okay, so this is practice three. You will listen again to the same audio, okay? But you have to circle the correct answer. One. Do you have any brothers and sisters, Stephanie? No brothers. I wish I did, but I've got three sisters. Really? Yeah, and I'm the youngest. Poor you. Two. Tell me about your family, Donna. Well, one brother. He's older than me. What does he do? He's a student, and I've got two younger sisters. Wow, you have a big family. Three. Do you have any brothers or sisters, Bob? Just one. My sister, Anna. Is she older than me? Yes, she is. She always bosses me around. Four. Tell me about your family, Rosie. Well, I come from quite a big family. I've got two brothers, both of them younger than me. Really? Do you have any sisters? Yeah, I have one older and one younger sister. You're lucky. I wish I came from a big family. Come from a big family, Tina? No, I'm an only child. It's just me and my parents. One. Do you have any brothers and sisters, Stephanie? No brothers. I wish I did, but I've got three sisters. Really? Yeah, and I'm the youngest. Poor you. Hey. Two. Tell me about your family, Donna. I think I have some brother. Uh, you have some problem? Yeah, I can't listen. Are you can't hear? Yeah, it's small and big and small and big. <laughs> oh, I think that is in the audio, my dear. Okay, but this is the same audio that we listened uh, earlier. Do you have any brothers and sisters, know. Stephanie? No brothers. I wish I did, but I've got three sisters. Really? Yeah, and I'm the youngest. Poor you. Okay. Two. Tell me about your family, Donna. Well, I've got one brother. He's older than me. What does he do? He's a student. And I've got two younger sisters. Wow, you have a big family. Okay, so let's check. Oh, wow, very good. Thank you. 
Okay, so this is practice 4.1. People are talking about themselves and other family members. Which family member is the speaker most similar to? Listen and track the correct answer. So put this one. Or you, you, can, you can put this one or you can just simply check it. Okay. In Ping. Both of my parents are taller than me. My dad is pretty tall. But my brother is even taller than my dad. Together they look like a basketball team. My sister and I are the short ones in the family. 2. Michael My brother isn't interested in music at all. He's into cars, like my dad. But I'm not interested in cars. I play the guitar and the piano. I guess I love music because of my mom. She sings beautifully. She plays the piano really well, too. 3. Justin I love animals. I have a dog and I keep a couple of parrots in a big cage in my room. I love taking photographs of wild birds when I'm in the countryside. My dad and I often go away for the weekend and we have a great time bird watching. My sister thinks I'm crazy. When my sister has free time, she loves to play cards. I can't stand card game. I enjoy reading. I read a lot of books and I love going to the library. My dad likes outdoor things. He's really into sports and swimming. And he always tells me I should get more interested in sports. But mom tells me that reading is the best way to learn. She always gives me books that she's been reading. Five. Robert. I'm very interested in computers. I'm always teaching myself new computer programs, and I have a lot of great software. My brother and I spend all our free time in computer skills and on the internet. My sister is more interested in the arts. She likes music, and she loves to read. She hates computers. 6. Beth. I love traveling. My mother and I go to a different place every year. Both of us love to learn new things about cultures. My father never goes with us because he hates flying. My older sister is in college, so she stays home and studies while we're away. Sometimes I wish my sister and my father would travel with us because I miss them. Okay, so um, let's read the tape script if we can't hear it clearly, okay? Hold on. I will look for the tape script so you could just read the tape script. Oh, where did he go? Okay, so this is the deep script. Okay, so again, people are talking about themselves and other family members. Which family member is the speaker most similar to? Listen and check the correct answer. Since uh, the, the, the audio is quite uh, weak, let's read the tape script. So this is the tape script. 
Okay, so number one, you can read it. Mm -hmm. I can't see your face. Hello? I can't see your face. Oh, you can't see me? Yep. Mm, why is that? Maybe that is on your settings. Hello? Now I see. Okay, hold on. But you can't see my screen. <laughs> okay. There we go. Can you see my screen? Yeah, but I don't see you. Oh. oh now I see. Okay, very nice. Okay, so read. Do, do you want to read it all and answer after, or do you want to go back and forth? No. Okay, so are you going to read it all and then answer? No. Okay, are oh, you going to read number one first and then you will answer number one? No! Oh, what are you going to do? <laughs> do you want to listen? Mm. Okay. Uh, if you say so, hold on. Okay, so again, this is a 4.1 since you said you want to listen. One. Wen Ping. Both of my parents are taller than me. My dad is pretty tall, but my brother is even taller than my dad. Together they look like a basketball team. My sister and I are the short ones in the family. 2. Michael. My brother isn't interested in music at all. He's into cars, like my dad. But I'm not interested in cars. I play the guitar and the piano. I guess I love music because of my mom. She sings beautifully. She plays the piano really well, too. 3. Justin I love animals. I have a dog and I keep a couple of parrots in a big cage in my room. I love taking photographs of wild birds when I'm in the countryside. My dad and I often go away for the weekend and we have a great time bird watching. My sister thinks I'm crazy. When my sister has free time, she loves to play cards. I can't stand card games. 4. Susan I enjoy reading. I read a lot of books and I love going to the library. My dad likes outdoor things. He's really into sports and swimming. And he always tells me I should get more interested in sports. But mom tells me that reading is the best way to learn. She always gives me books that she's been reading. 5. Robert I'm very interested in computers. I'm always teaching myself new computer programs, and I have a lot of great software. My brother and I spend all our free time in computer stores and on the Internet. My sister is more interested in the arts. She likes music, and she loves to read. She hates computers. 6. Beth. I love traveling. My mother and I go to a different place every year. Both of us love to learn new things about cultures. My father never goes with us because he hates flying. My older sister is in college, so she stays home and studies while we're away. Sometimes I wish my sister and my father would travel with us because I miss them. Okay, so let's answer. Ready? Okay, very good. Oh, number one, Justin is like... Okay, Susan is mother, brother, and mother.
Okay, so another practice uh, in listening activity. This is 4.2. I will play the same audio, but now you have to put letters on the numbers, okay? So how is each family member different from the speaker? Write the letter. Okay, it's like a matching type. One, Wen Ping. Both of my parents are taller than me. My dad is pretty tall, but my brother is even taller than my dad. Together, they look like a basketball team. My sister and I are the first ones in the family. Two, Michael. My brother isn't interested in music at all. He's into cars, like my dad. But I'm not interested in cars. I play the guitar and the piano. I guess I love music because of my mom. She sings beautifully. She plays the piano really well, too. Three, Justin. I love animals. I have a dog and I keep a couple of parrots in a big cage in my room. I love taking photographs of wild birds when I'm in the countryside. My dad and I often go away for the weekend and we have a great time bird watching. My sister thinks I'm crazy. When my sister has free time, she loves to play cards. I can't stand card games. Four, Susan. I enjoy reading. I read a lot of books and I love going to the library. My dad likes outdoor things. He's really into sports and swimming. And he always tells me I should get more interested in sports. But mom tells me that reading is the best way to learn. She always gives me books that she's been reading. Five, Robert. I'm very interested in computers. I'm always teaching myself new computer programs, and I have a lot of great software. My brother and I spend all our free time in computer stores and on the internet. My sister is more interested in the arts. She likes music, and she loves to read. She hates computers. Six. Beth. I love traveling. My mother and I go to a different place every year. Both of us love to learn new things about cultures. My father never goes with us because he hates flying. My older sister is in college, so she stays home and studies while we're away. Sometimes I wish my sister and my father would travel with us because I miss them. Okay, my dear, you have to write the letters, okay? The letters, not the numbers. Okay, so I will play it again. One, Wen Ping. Both of my parents are taller than me. My dad is pretty tall, but my brother is even taller than my dad. Together, they look like a basketball team. My sister and I are the short ones in the family. Two, Michael. My brother isn't interested in music at all. He's into cars, like my dad. But I'm not interested in cars. I play the guitar and the piano. I guess I love music because of my mom. She sings beautifully. She plays the piano really well, too. Three. Justin. I love animals. I have a dog and I keep a couple of parrots in a big cage in my room. I love taking photographs of wild birds when I'm in the countryside. My dad and I often go away for the weekend and we have a great time bird watching. My sister thinks I'm crazy. When my sister has free time, she loves to play cards. I can't stand card games. Four, Susan. I enjoy reading. I read a lot of books and I love going to the library. My dad likes outdoor things. He's really into sports and swimming. And he always tells me I should get more interested in sports. But mom tells me that reading is the best way to learn. She always gives me books that she's been reading. 
Five. Robert. I'm very interested in computers. I'm always teaching myself new computer programs, and I have a lot of great software. My brother and I spend all our free time in computer stores and on the internet. My sister is more interested in the arts. She likes music and she loves to read. She hates computers. Six. Beth. I love traveling. My mother and I go to a different place every year. Both of us love to learn new things about cultures. My father never goes with us because he hates flying. My older sister is in college, so she stays home and studies while we're away. Sometimes I wish my sister and my father would travel with us because I miss them. Okay, so let's check. Number one is letter C, likes reading and music. Number two is letter F, is it interested in music? Uh, number three, Justin, sister. Okay, very good. You did well. Uh, letter D, prefers to play cards. And number four is letter A, very nice, it's already given. Number five, letter B, very good. So, uh, likes reading and music. And number six, it's letter E. Good job. Isn't interested in music. Okay. Where is that? Okay, so this is the tip script. Okay, so this is just three uh, tip scripts. <laughs> Let me see. What time is it? Oh, it's already time. Okay, those are just tip scripts. Oh. Okay, my dear, so uh, do you have a question before we end our class today? Uh, no. Okay, so again, you are not going to be absent for the pet holiday, right? Mm, yes. Okay, very nice. So let's see each other again tomorrow, okay? Mm, okay. Okay, goodbye. Bye.